Good morning, everybody. Crypto Strang here. Following from yesterday's video, let's talk about Aptos and the mainnet launch, and also today being the day that you start the exchange listings. I wasn't aware they're literally going to go on all the top tier exchanges today. It's absolutely incredible. Literally, on, in one day, they've listed on all the top exchanges you can imagine. Okay, so as you can imagine, we spoke yesterday about the volatility the price will be. You can see today, here we are, we're straight in at ranked 52 on coin market cap. Which is absolutely incredible to think that on your basic big launch on the exchanges, you've gone straight in at rank 52 with a market cap 966 million. Okay, volume in the last 24 hours over 1 billion. Now, following off the video yesterday, we talked about supply. You can see there the current supply is 130 million. We spoke yesterday the fact that basically we had all that staked in, we 820 just staked, 820 million already state when they're locked in for 12 months okay so we talked about volatility the price not as volatile as you kind of imagine i saw on coin gecko they're actually saying about a high of 13 dollars 53 on coin market they're saying about a high of 8 dollars 55 currently 7 dollars 42 we've had a low on here according to 6 dollars 69 so not as volatile as i say as we was expecting but i was talking about the exchanges yes we spoke about binance and ftx yeah and they're the biggest volumes at the moment you can see binance look at that volume 353 million which is 31 percent okay unbelievable okay a lot of people obviously been waiting for this to come on people long-term hold like myself okay but it's just caused to, i've never seen this before when you've gone on all the top tiers you can scroll down here obviously we spoke about as i say the binance ftx we've got huobi gate ku coin Favorites gate and KU coin is always there. He will be another fantastic exchange. Bitfinex Coinbase, very rare that Coinbase gets a brand new project straight onto Coinbase. Okay, it's on Kraken, OKX, MEXC, Bybit, L Bank, Bitmart, you know, BitTrue. It's just on so many sites, it's unbelievable. And that is why they're getting so much um, trading today. And the volume is absolutely incredible, it truly is. I said, I've never seen that before. And then that speaks volumes for the project. I spoke very fondly about this yesterday. Their plans, their development. Time will tell how pop they become with the people building on Aptos. But at the moment, what a what a fantastic start for the team. You know, they couldn't have envisaged such a wonderful start. Okay, truly is unbelievable. Now, what they've also done, they've created another Twitter. <laughs> so basically, this is Aptos Labs. Okay, and it basically was, it states here, you can see there, welcome to Aptos Labs. We're excited to reintroduce ourselves. Aptos Foundation, the Twitter, that's the one where it was so yesterday, will support and develop the Aptos network and ecosystem. Labs will develop tooling. So Aptos Foundation will still give the updates, but Aptos Labs is another Twitter feed. So I want to talk about Aptos Foundation. That's the one that's got over 230,000 followers. So they're still obviously running that as well. But... I want to show you also today how to buy. I've had quite a few comments suggesting, quite a few messages saying, what's going on all these exchanges? You know, can you show us how to buy on an exchange? Okay, so I'm actually going to show you how to do on KU coin. I've showed Binance many times and also OKX, UOB, uh, all of them, MEXC. I've showed them before. So I'm actually going to show you on KU coin today. But I'll show you that in a minute. Another bit I didn't cover yesterday was the Aptos launch. Get early access to the new Aptos ideas. Okay, now this is another. Website there's aptoslaunch.io, community driven launch pad, powering the Aptos Web 3.0 economy, empowering crypto projects with the ability to raise liquidity on the safest and most scalable layer one blockchain. Okay, so they said launch your project with Aptos Launch. It's the first decentralized launch pad on the Aptos network. With Aptos building the safest and most scalable layer one blockchain for the next billion users, Aptos Launch is engineered from the ground up to empower Aptos project owners okay your new super stake your aptos launch tokens okay so again they're talking about aptos launch having a separate sort of tokens which again something to keep an eye on that can have massive potential as again projects build on aptos and it just keeps developing again it's just another part of their ecosystem that just keeps giving doesn't it they've also got their own twitter as well another twitter <laughs> account for aptos this is just the launch side of things you can see there it's got nearly twenty one thousand followers alone it talks there about a demo IDO competition, the biggest event on Aptos. Our media partners will compete to see who can generate more sales on our demo and where it drops. They're looking for that. But I think, you know, they've got Aptos launched now as well. They've got so many Twitter feeds. I'll just keep on top of all of it. Um, there's a lot of information on here about what Aptos launch is doing. Okay, so it really is fascinating to see. They're just It's just constantly evolving. Obviously, been developing for four years. I've been planning for the mainnet launch, which happened literally last week. And then, obviously, the actual 
coin itself launched today. But I, say, I just couldn't believe it this morning to wake up to see it was on all the top tier exchanges. You know, I didn't see on Bittrex, for example, but pretty much I couldn't think of many other top ones that I really liked that wasn't on. So it was actually fascinating to see. Now, when it comes to basically KU coin, now I know I've showed KU coin before. Now, I, thought, I love KU coin. I say I've been on it for years. Wonderful thing. Now, obviously, you can send crypto from any other exchange to KU coin. I've showed that many times, but to actually buy crypto with fiat on KU coin is very easy. I've never had any issues. Here in the UK, we do have a lot of problems. Unless you're doing a bank transfer, there's not many problems with that, but actually using a credit card or a debit card. I don't know about people out there, but me personally, I'm struggling where my local bank, the NatWest, sort of don't accept it. You know, even the credit cards are not very good, but there is a few here in the UK do it, like Marks and Spencer's bank do it. I know the Revolut does, HSBC. I think the Halifax are fairly crypto-friendly. But again, that's the sort of issues we, we face, don't we? But I say, that's just using your cards. Bank transfers, especially like it's a bit panda, is no problems at all. Binance, the bank transfers, and Coinbase as well. But obviously, bank transfers take longer. It's so much easier to use cards. But we do have a huge block here in the UK. However, KU Coin does allow my credit card to go on it. So again, you've got to do your own research, especially in a bear market, even more so. Do you want to get in crypto yet? Do you want to wait? Have we reached the bottom yet? Will there be further lows? So again, you've got to do your own research. But what I do on here, I simply just put in 150, you know, GBP, and it was me exactly how much USDT I will get. Okay, so it's very straightforward, and you just buy it, you go through the verification with your credit card provider, and then obviously it just goes through once you've approved it. So when you've actually gone through that whole scenario it doesn't take long it takes more than oh, I don't know, one two minutes you've then got you received your 161 usdt okay now with ku coin a bit different from our exchange in some respect it goes straight into your main account now for actually you to trade and actually get an, another coin another token then you have to transfer it to your trading account so you can see here my tether is there so all i have to do is just transfer main account to trading account now obviously just hit there and it's literally instantly it's no problem it doesn't take long at all so there's a success okay so now i'll go on to the trading side of things and you can see that i've got my balance now it's, it's laid out very similar to all the other exchanges ku coin but what you do on is slightly different up here what you do here is just see that bit where it scrolls down always defaults to bitcoin and tether so what I do is I just tap in here the project I want to get. So I want to get myself some more APT. Now, talk about volatility, who knows where APT? I wouldn't be surprised tomorrow if we had a dump, you know, but I'm thinking long term of this project. A project had a $350 million investment and what their site is stating, the huge team behind it and how visible it is. And the fact is already reached 52 in the charts. For the next bull run, I'm very hopeful that Aptos will have a massive pump. Now you can see there the change is at the moment plus 177%. So... KU coin obviously a lot of volatility. That's why I think coin market cap haven't exactly got the all time high correct today. But however, so it's simple as that. You just hit that, and then obviously up there you can see it defaults to Aptos USDT as well. Now you come over here, and obviously you can buy, you can sell, etc. Now again, it says here I've got nothing to sell. However, I've got Aptos, but obviously it's in my main account, and that's the difference with like Binance, where it's all based on one account. With KU coin, if I want to sell my APT, I'd have to transfer it back from main account to trading account, like I just showed you with the tether. So you can see here now, obviously, the price at the moment I say is fairly steady. I'm a bit surprised how steady it is. So I'll just hit that, and then I'll do 100% of my tether. So that's going to give me 21.27 Aptos. Then it's very simple. There's, there's many different ways you've got all these stop limits, etc. But I just, for ease on this video, I'm just going to literally show you there. Now, what I like also is they've got a passcode, which obviously I'm going to put in. Now you can see there now, you can see it's rolling around by APT. You can see you've placed the order successfully, and that is basically gone straight through. Sometimes it come up here at the bottom here, where it says like open orders and it's going through, but that went through instantly, okay? So now I've got 34.67. Okay, now what I've got to do is now transfer that back to my main account. I like to keep everything on my main account on KU Coin. But also another part I've got to show on Aptos, they've got their own this petrol wallet, which again is your own personal wallet, which I will be creating myself and just storing it on there. I do hold stuff on KU Coin, so I've used it for many, many years. But however, I just want to I like my own private wallets. But I'm happy to keep on the exchange, especially all the security side of it as well. Okay, now I need to look into the fact about this petrol wallet. You know, once it's on there, can I withdraw it? Because you see about all them investors, etc. They've got a 12 month wait. So 
So I'm going to look into the fact that if I do sell them, they won't be able to withdraw it. You know, if I wanted to take some profits, if you're in a crazy price. But I think at the moment, I say, on day on this launch day, on all these exchanges, you've got to be very careful and do your own research. Who knows where the price will be? Say, so obviously, we could have a huge pump, or we could have a dump tomorrow, for example. Who knows? Time will tell. Um, so that's pretty much it, really. I just want to give a... I've had a few messages. I thought to show how easy it is on KU coin. I say I could... There's many other exchanges, but I've shown them in before. But I haven't shown KU coin for quite a while. So... Also, something that they've just announced as well, as there's so much going on with the project day, is the launch of the Aptos name services on the main net. This is exciting. We're excited to officially introduce the Aptos name service. We're paving the way by building a best in class blockchain experience with Aptos, which is why we're launching the name service. ANS allows all Aptos users now to use a human readable dot APT name. Okay, there's many projects done this before, um, different, different domains. So Aptos wallet address instead of their public key. Now they see Aptos names as a crypto step towards broad user adoption of the Aptos blockchain. And it states here about the benefits. Better user experience and this offers streamlined onboarding through human readable APT addresses, unique Web3 identity, target address and subdomains using your name, how to get your Aptos name, they give you a brief detail there. So it's just another part of the what their plans are now they're developing. There's almost a lot going on. That's why they've got such a big team behind it. As you see, for, you know, we've got enough. Twitter feeds now to follow this free that I'll be following about the Aptos project now. So, as I say, I'll just give a quick overview of how to buy on KU coin. Anyone need help? Obviously, just email me info crypto strand.com or my social media links below. Don't hesitate to reach out anywhere I can if you're struggling, but do your own research before you buy Aptos. You may just want the project to settle, I say, it might be going to further all time lows, it might even drop further the price. So, do your own research, okay. But I'm very bullish on this project, especially for the next ball run. Who knows what this price will be? People have compared it to being the, the Solana, challenge the Solana and Avalanche, etc. Only time will tell. Okay, so the fact it's already at rank 52 does speak huge volumes for the project long term. So thanks very much. Have a wonderful day. We will chat again soon. Cheers now. Bye.